Saturday afternoon at Fred's garage, my wife caught me working on her motorcycle, so we have to do a video of that. Meanwhile, though, we have a beautiful GTO here, 1968 for sale. It could be yours. Give me a call. 508 272. I can't tell you the rest of the number. <laughs> okay, this is a little Harley here I found that had no headlight. All the other lights were working, brake lights, directionals. But I took the, the headlight out and it's been worked on by several of her old boyfriends. But it had uh, a Mickey Mouse ground wire kit. This is what, this was uh, fried, not making a ground. So I did it with the test light. I took a test light and ran, made sure the high beam and low beam, the light bulb was not gone. So now if you turn it on, I replaced that wire. Okay, uh, right here we got high beam, low beam. All right, hold on. Now, hold on but a to do that. Hold on a minute. Hold on, because I can't get that wire. Did the wire have to rehearse its lines? Okay, to do this now was not simple. We had to take the windshield off, take the two rings around the seal beam off, and now I have to cap it. I'm not worried about the ground wire again, but I'm worried about this is gonna go over the rest of the switch here, over the rip, so the two live wires won't get it. And then it's just uh, reverse the seat to put it all back together and it's done. That's my motorcycle. I just drive that it's a Japanese bike. We don't have to work on. That's my friend Billy Troy, Vietnam vet, a friend for life. Richie's a new friend that Billy introduced me to. They're both uh, ex city workers in the beautiful city of Newton, which I was raised and born and raised. That's about it in Fred's garage for today. Goodbye. Subscribe and push the like button. Ring the bell and all that stuff that I don't know about. It's free. It doesn't cost anything. I'm being coached here. So, goodbye. All right. I'm just putting this cap back over the two live wires to the lights. And I'm just going to tape over the ground wire. And then everything goes back together. This is going right in here. Just see the ground wire sticks out a little bit. That's not a live wire, that's a ground. All right? And then I guess. What did you just do again? I put this cover, snap this cover back on. It snaps on. Yeah. And holds these wires in place. And this is the ground that, that's a new wire I had to put in there. Oh, that's the wire that you yeah. had. All right, let me see if I can get that focused in. Okay, so this is the wire right here, the blue one that you replaced. You bought a new one, and then those... These rims okay, have to... The i got to plug this back in there and put one rim on. It's a double rim. There's two of these. And this goes on first after this plugs into here. And before we put the rims on, we want to double check and make sure the lights work. There's... High beam, low beam, low beam, high beam, whatever. That's high, all right, it's working. Now, I have to put this trim rim back on and keep it off to the side. I didn't want to lose that. Spend more time when you lose stuff. Is that like a clamp, right? Yeah, it's two clamps, yeah, it's a double clamp, which is a good idea. But you gotta get it so turned over here so you can tighten it. Yeah. Not set right then. Let me get the screwdriver.
you gotta get the screw so you can get it from the side over here So does it have to always be to the right side where the wire is? Because that's where it clips in? That's where it was. Okay, that's where it was. Yeah. Is it harder to get it in over there? You can't no, I get, I get a shot of it right here. I just pull the wire down. That's right exactly where it was. Mm -hmm. Use it for a reference. Yeah. It's blinding me. Yeah. Okay. Get this locked up in the Light. Yeah, the light's right in my head. Why don't you shut that one off? Double check again before we put the windshield on. Well, how do you feel about it, Fred? Well, you know what? I just have to bolt the windshield on, but before I do that, I'm going to clean up in here. So that's just about it. The headlights working. The two rims are on. It's nice and tight. And this windshield's going back on. There's three bolts on each side. And it has a uh, lock tight on it. So that was all because the ground wire was all frayed yeah and that's what you discovered was that the ground wire was all frayed and that's we, we tried to take a picture of it frayed earlier in the other video yeah. but um why it was frayed so that's why the lights kept not working and the battery wasn't charging or oh, that's got nothing to do with that, that, that had with nothing to do. here's the wire right here oh yeah there's the wire <clears throat> this was all frayed yeah i just don't know it if wasn't i can focus in on it i'm not sure no, won't focus. No, won't focus, but it's all frayed. Believe us, people, it's all frayed. And so. it, it was lost to ground. So this is a, a new wire, a new ground, and it works. Subscribe. Bye. Don't forget to subscribe. Ring the bell, push the buttons, do whatever you do, subscribe. Fun with Fred. Fun with Fred. Another Saturday. Thanks, Fred. Bye-bye.